yo, 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 it's D Arthur in the building. Talking to you guys today about seed retention. The female attraction is crazy. Um, so, I mean, the one thing about semen, semen retention and just like female attraction is, I mean, obviously you're just going to get more attention from women if that's what you want. But that shouldn't be... That shouldn't be your main focus because i mean if you're if you're just getting if you're just getting if you're just doing this for the sake of woman attraction then you're missing the point you're missing the point see the reason why i even put like the female attraction is crazy in the title is because it gets clicks it gets it's clickbait as soon as as soon as you guys see the the title female attraction and semen retention they're, they're just more views and more views turn into more revenue streams. But the thing is, is like the reason why you've lost already is because you're focused on the female attraction. You're literally focused on them. You're literally focused. Women do not like a man who's always focused on them. You have to get busy. And, and when I say busy, I, I don't mean, I mean actually, like actually busy. Like you actually are doing a lot of things that are is helping your life in a pendulum swing. There's this thing called a snowball effect, and the thing is, like, if you go, if you, if you, if you at least improve at least like one percent every day, you get better. You're doing something that's noteworthy. You're doing something that's creative. You're doing something that's out thinking outside of the box. And you're eventually getting good at it. You have a skill. You're 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 finally having some sort of purpose. And basically, I mean, the more purpose you have, the easier it is to attract men and women alike. Because people like people like people who who seem like they have things going on. Who seem like they they're about something. They have some sort of um passion for something this is this is pretty much how you get woman attraction but like i said if you're if you literally have nothing going on and then you're focused on the woman attraction you're 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 asking questions like how long did you go and see more attention until you got until you get until you get woman attraction you're literally missing the point the whole point of seeing more attention is to create a dynamic life is to create a life that is very interesting one that you're actually satisfied with one is that that is not normal because you have you have extra energy you have your amplified energy levels are helping you create a more more interesting life and then when that is said and done which is which will probably never be said and done because you're always increasing you're always wanting more some the people who are meant to be the people who who you think who are showing a lot of interest and they're making it they're making it easier for you to be to be with them they're not putting some sort of defense they're not they're not making you go through all these hoops and swing and swings and pendulums um to, to be with them then you you reward them with your attention and your time if if you're attracted to them but you can't just be you can't just be going for you can't just be going out your way for somebody at the beginning if they haven't I mean if they haven't showed you any attraction or you can't just be like buying them things at the beginning just so they can get interest in you that's not how that's not how attraction works attraction works by your energy attraction works by how you make her feel when you're talking to her attraction works by helps by how you look Attraction is the energy, the subconscious communications that both of you are giving off subconsciously. We have people, we have people who say things like, "It's not about sub, it's not about energy, subconscious, or anything like that. It's about if she if she likes you or not. It's about it's about like what you wear. It's about it's about like how you look. And there's two types. There's two types of things to attraction. There is there is woman there is the invisible attraction the subconscious communication triggers and then how you physically look physical looks can get you in the door but if you're not making her feel a certain way when you're when you're with her then you're, you can never really keep her around that's why it's very important to have high energy levels to be very enthusiastic 
to be hitting the gym because if you hit the gym you have more testosterone you have the the conversation is a little bit more satisfying because you you're playing more of your masculine dynamic and she's playing more of her feminine dynamic but you guys are too feminine you guys are you guys never hit the gym but you're focused on woman attraction you guys never ha you have you haven't gotten a haircut in two months but you're focused on woman attraction make, make it make sense there has to be things that you that you have to take care of before anything before anything happens there has to be things that you're purposeful about there has to be things that you're really willing that you're willing to go all in for in order before you start talking about women attraction i mean the f yes you will definitely get more female attraction if you're on retention and you hit the gym consistently because just by just by meta metaphysical standpoint uh you just have a lot more energy um you just have more testosterone you're giving off you're, you're giving off very masculine energy vibes to the to the world and let's say Let's, cause this has happened to me one time where I was working out, been on retention, and then I was I just got done with my workout, and then I check my phone, and then there's a notification on Tinder, and then this person messages me first. And these are this is none of this ha is happening by coincidence. All of this is happening by the energetic masculine energy that I'm giving off. The stronger the the energy the energy field is the easier it is for you to come the easier for it is for you to be attracted for a woman to be attracted to you but you're just not as you don't have as much tea as possible you're just not you're just, you're just not on you're not you're not on seed retention for long enough to really make this work but then again you shouldn't be focusing on the woman <clears throat> so anyways anyways um so like I said, these red pill content creators, a lot of a lot of these red pill content creators, um, they're the most of them are just most of them have big egos, like really big egos. And and then they use the red pill to kind of cover up their own insecurities. This is this is what I found to what I've really found out. Like we have people who are just so insecure about themselves that the moment some someone does something wrong to them, they have this this pent up wall that they made and they just think that they just take it to heart. And if you if you're really that bothered by what other people think of you that much, then you, you, you're not, you're really never gonna last in this world. Anyways, so anyways, like I was saying, like like it should it should your focus should not be on the woman focus should be on improving yourself and then as a byproduct the women who are naturally attracted to you they'll they're going to stick around they're they're going to want to uh, speak with you they're going to want to they're going to want to be with you um just because you're really not you're, you have things going on you're you're a high valuable man you're giving out honest signals that you're high value and the person and then and then Certain specific women will start to stick around, but then there are specific women who won't stick around. Watch out for the women who 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 make it tough for you, um, to try to get them, because if they're making it tough for you, then there's really no point to pursuing them. There's really no point. I don't care how much you like her, how much how much this and that. If she's making it ten times as hard for you to to get with her it's not worth it it wouldn't be worth it because think about how you would be if you were actually in a relationship with her she doesn't appreciate the things that you do she doesn't even appreciate you she's making things hard for you because she doesn't appreciate you so you have to find someone who who appreciates you appreciates who who you are because like i mean you can you can break your back go out your way for for a specific woman but She's not really going to, if she's not really willing to do the same thing for you, it's never going to work. It's never really going to stick around. So anyways, um, like I said, so I'm saying at the beginning, you shouldn't really be going out your way for the woman. Um, you guys, if you, if, if it looks like there's attraction there, I mean, you guys figure something out, but I mean, you should start really, really being, showing her. That you, I mean, you guys like her at, at the kind of in the middle or on when it's really an established thing. But if you're doing that at the beginning, it really isn't going to work that well. So, I mean, yes, you're going to get woman attraction. Um, 
you're gonna if you go let's say if you were to go on see more attention for 60 days and the key part is hitting the gym and actually going hard in the gym if you're leaving and, and if you're a guy like if you're leaving all of that if you're doing at least those two things you're definitely going to get more attraction just because your testosterone levels have risen up and women are attracted to testosterone they don't like the the super beefy like steroid type of dudes but they like a guy who has a little bit of testosterone and who has masculine energy that's pretty much it and who stands on his own two feet but i mean if you're not doing that if you're if you're easy to bend easy to break you're too feminine you care too much you're really never going to get anywhere with anything and that's in life in general that's life in general so yes yeah, woman attraction uh, it will come to you but you're too focused on the woman to, for it to actually care because if she pulls back you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna <laughs> you have to have this art of detachment you can't be attached to anything regardless of who she is what it, what she has done for you you can never be too attached because if you're too attached things may go wrong and then since you're attached to it you're gonna lead to suffering the buddha said attachment is the root of all suffering you can never be attached you can like her but you can never be attached to her so i mean yes you will get woman attraction but if you're too focused on them you're never gonna it's never gonna stick you have to build yourself up you really have to self-improve you really have to f find out who you are you really have to get busy in something you have to find you have to figure something out you have to be you have to be passionate about something and then sooner or later the, the type of woman that you want will start tend to stick around this is this is the laws of nature um so yeah like the video see some thumbs up comment comment down something um subscribe if you haven't already and then um if you have any more questions click on the link below i will and submit a question i will do my best to over deliver in my response until then we'll see you in the next one peace